Hey everybody, it's Chantel. Welcome back to the channel, or welcome if you're new. So today I'm going to give you my review of my stay at the Spring Hill Suites by Marriott, Newark Liberty International Airport. Yes, I had to say that slow because it is a long title. <laughs> so me and my sister stayed here when we went to see NCT at the Prudential Center. And let me tell you, it was very enjoyable and convenient. Here, I'll show you why that is and if I recommend it. But first, let me show you the hotel and I'll come back with my final thoughts. So as you can see, the hotel is very nice, it's clean, and it has the basics. But here are a few things to know. As with anything, try to find a deal, whether you're signing up through the Marriott program or through a third party website. 
I use TripAdvisory and I have their TripAdvisory Plus service. It's a paid subscription. So for one night and two adults, I paid $122.75. Check-in is at 3 p.m. and check-out is at 12 p.m. The Wi-Fi is good and free. They offer free airport transportation. They have shuttles and uh, they can call a taxi service too. This hotel was in the middle of the highway. So in order for you to get downtown, you would have to jump on the highway, but it's literally 10 minutes away. So that's not bad, but to walk around, you can't do that because across from Spring Hill Suites is another hotel. So not a good area to walk around. But for it to be next to Newark Liberty Airport, it's not that noisy. So it, that's that's really good. Spring Hill Suites could use some updates, especially with their outlets. There are not many outlets and they don't have USB-C outlets. So it's always good to always bring your own chargers, but bring a surge protector. The bathroom is spacious, but it can still feel tight. I just wanted to show you guys how close the toilet is to the tub. So it's like this, this close and close there. You have room in the shower. It has, it what? <laughs> it has this here to help, but I think it would have been a little better if this, they had another one here. And if they moved the toilet over, you would have more room. Um, And then to the, if you want to side, to the papers right there. So if you're bigger bodied or you need more assistance and accessibility, the bathroom will be fine, but I just wanted to mention that because it could be a problem. If you plan to stay overnight like we did, I paid $17 for parking. And you can pay that at the beginning or at the end of your stay. They give you a ticket and that's what you'll use to get in and out of the hotel. They do serve breakfast for free. It's continental buffet style. And that was from 6 a.m. to 9.30 a.m. on Monday through Fridays and 7 a.m. to 10 a.m. on Saturday and Sunday. Uh, it, was, it was basic. They had eggs and sausage. They had a cereal station. They had some fruit and oatmeal station, yogurt, juice station. It was only apple and orange of course they had coffee and tea and they also had a bagel section station they had a bagel section they had a bagel station section <laughs> the food was okay and you can also eat at the lot in the little lobby or you can just bring it up to your room I do recommend this hotel particularly if you're staying one night or maybe two if you need it there's not really much to do. It's convenience at best, for real. Also, the staff were really nice and um, the cleaning crew were really nice as well. Well, that was my review from the Spring Hill Suites by Marriott, Newark International Liberty Airport. It was really nice, very convenient, and I, again, would recommend it. So thank you so much for watching. Please let me know what you guys think and if you have any questions, I'll do my best to help you in the comments below. Thank you again, and I'll see you later.